for the cheapest, fastest, most reliable muck coins in the market, check out my coin sponsors at AOEAH.com and use discount code MONEY for 3% off. Link in the description below. Welcome back, Money Team. This is Mad Money Shot. Sniff of the Mad Cheese, as always. Got another top five video for you guys today. Today, I'm going to be going over my top five offensive and defensive playbooks to use in Madden 23. Now, I do this video every year. It's usually pretty successful. I'm going to do it. This video is going to serve a couple different purposes. Number one, I'm going to tell you guys the best playbooks, in my opinion, to use. Number two, these are going to be the playbooks that I use in my upcoming videos. When I make videos about, you know, offenses and defenses, stuff like that, they're going to come from these two specific uh, categories of playbooks. So, you, if you're going to follow this channel, if you're going to try to, you know, use a lot of the plays that I put out throughout the year, these are going to be the ones that I focus on the most at the beginning of the year. Now, as the game changes and as I learn new playbooks, if uh, you guys want to see an update video of this, as Woo! always, hit the like button and let me know in the comment section. If you have a favorite playbook that you want me to check out, please let me know in the comment section because it's possible that you have a better playbook than the ones that I'm choosing. And I'm always changing. If you guys follow my channel, you know that as the year goes on, I typically change playbooks like I change shirts. The first team on my list is is going to be the subject of my first ebook which is almost complete it's the new orleans saint here is one of the glitchiest playbooks every single year and it's been that way for a long time this is probably one of the most patched playbooks in the game over the last five years and it's still one of the best now this is also one of the most diverse i mean it has some of the best single back formations like the wing pair which is one of the best running formations in the game the deuce close which is one of the best running formations and there's a lot of really great offensive plays with like passing plays i have a one play touchdown in this particular formation against every single defense in the game that i'll probably be bringing out pretty soon same thing with the wing stack the wing stack has a one play touchdown against every single defense in the game the tie way off is one of the best passing formations in the entire playbook doubles Flex, really great running formation when it comes to shotgun plays it's loaded there and it has a lot of really unique plays my personal favorite formation is probably the m2y saint it's been that way for a very long time i'm gonna have a video coming out pretty soon on this particular play here the saints drags which if you watch my channel you probably remember that you have a ton of really great passing formations though the stack y flex love that formation pass and run the bunch is really good obviously the tray offset is always one of the meta formations uh one of my favorite though and to me maybe the best passing formation in the entire game is the the gun tight offset te before i get too deep in the video though i did want to say that my coin sponsors aoes.com already have coins for sale even though the game's not even officially out yet so if you guys want to get ahead on your mutt team the second you get your hands on the game check them out link in the description below you discount code money to get three percent off it's always guaranteed to be the cheapest coins on the market last year this was one of my first free ebooks that i put out on my channel and it got almost a hundred thousand views over the course of madden 22 so i know you guys like the niners it's been one of the better playbooks for a very long time and i probably be the second ebook that i put out my favorite thing about this particular formation is definitely going to be the shotguns the split close pro and the debo package and the regular split close which is probably the best out of all three are all very good formations this one here is probably the best running and passing i always put out a full breakdown of this offense it's definitely one of my favorites the bunch wide is a pretty good passing formation but once again going back to the gun tight this is one of my favorite passing formations in the entire game it's not as good as the one in the saints but it's still one of the best ones in the entire game i could spend if i'm if i need to pass i could spend the entire game in this formation it has some really good strong and iphone formations a couple years back the strong close was one of the meta formations and a few years before that the iphone close was one of the meta formations they're all very good and it also has a ton of really good single bag plays and formations the wing pair still one of the best running formations in the game the deuce close the same i think i mentioned both of them in the saints formations that the saints doesn't have is the single bag wing and the single bag wing flex close which is one of my favorite formations in the game as well so those are two definite additions including the single back bunch te which to me was much better when it was the pistol bunch to E, but it's still a very good formation with a lot of really good plays. The Ravens along with the Cardinals are probably the most unique playbooks in the game. So if you run these particular playbooks, not a lot of people are going to know what the hell you're doing. One of my favorite things about the Ravens is their pistol formations. If you ask me, the pistol formation might be the best formation package in the entire game. And this particular playbook has so many good ones. My favorite one's probably the pistol week. Uh, you guys might notice that my, my, you know, combination where I typically run the triple option and halfback zone week along with a lot of other things out of that there's also some really good ones like the strong the strong eye wing the strong slot they're all very good this has a ton of really good and unique shotgun formations
formations as well. Plays like, or formations like the empty quads, which is pretty rare. Um, it's a very explosive passing, you know, formation that was introduced last year. The split close pro is really good. They upgraded that. The deuce close is pretty good. Uh, the wing slot weak, that's one of my personal favorites. The normal Y off close out of this particular playbook might be my favorite passing formation in the entire game. I love every single play in this formation. If you watched any of my videos towards the end of Madden 22, the Chiefs became one of my favorite playbooks. It was mostly because of this particular formation right here. Once again, another pistol formation. This just entire formation is just loaded with glitchy plays. And this is only found in the Chiefs playbook, or at least it was last year. They have a lot of other good formations too. The, the wing pair, which I mentioned, one of the best running formations in the game. The deuce close, also one of the best running formations in the game. The wing flex, which hasn't been in any of the playbooks I've mentioned so far, is a very good run and pass formation. And the tight way off is always one of the best formations out of single back each and every year is it's essentially a shotgun tight. You have another very unique running formation which is the jumbo strong which is essentially like a goal line package. Then you get to some of the shotgun plays and you really have some of the metas. I already mentioned the normal while off close but it really is all about the bunch formations. The bunch halfback strong is a very good bunch formation play and then you also have the meta gun bunch te which is still probably going to be one of the most overpowered uh, you know series in the game. But one of my favorite playbooks from last year and that's the buffalo bills. Once again, we have a very unique pistol formation, which I will start off with the open flex close. I did a lot of series of videos on this particular formation last year, especially the RPO read flat wheel and the inside zone. Very good run and pass play there. Uh, they have a lot of really good single back formations, including the wing pair and the deuce close, which like I said, are pretty much always meta. The wing I mentioned, the wing slot I mentioned already, the bunch ace, all these are very good. The double off close is very good as well. They have a ton of really good shotgun formations though. The split slot is a very good formation. The normal wild close, which I've mentioned twice now, was in the Chiefs and the Ravens. And then they have a couple of really unique formations like the Trips TE, the Bunch, obviously. The Gun Tight, once again, I love Gun Tight. I could stay my entire game in Gun Tight. So if that's it for the offense, let's go and switch to the defensive side. The Dolphins is still one of the best playbooks in the game. They still have the 3-4 odd, which is one of the best every single year, and it has been for a long time. They have a bear, which is a pretty good run formation, but at the end of the day, I'm pretty much going to stay in the 3-4 odd the entire time. The 4-3 even 6-1 is one of the best 4-3 uh, formations in the game, and it still is. I've been on that since it came out. Then you get to the nickel, and they have all the nickel you need. The regular nickel, which is called the 2-4 now. The 3-3 odd, which is called the 3-5 odd, is a pretty good formation. You have your double mug, which is typically called the double A gap, and you have your 3-3 cub, which which used to be called a 3-3-5. That's pretty much all you need. You get to the dime formations and you have your dollar replacement in the 2-3-6 SAM and your 1-4, which gives you plenty of blitzes to come out of those two packages. Next up, we have my favorite defense from Madden 21, which was the Kansas City Chiefs. This playbook hasn't changed too much since then. It's still one of the best. You have your 4-3 even 6-1 once again. That's pretty much the only one I would use, but the 4-3 over solid is actually pretty good. What really makes this onto the list is the addition of the big nickel over G. That's an important formation. It's still one of the best formations in the game. You have your regular nickel, and you also have your 3-3, which used to be called the 3-3-5. Then you get to the dime normal. This is one of my favorite dime formations, to be honest with you, because you have four dime linemen. It's still a very good run defense, and it's also a very good pass defense. You have your regular dollar, which is obviously important because every playbook that I mentioned has it. This might be my favorite defense from this year, and that's the Raiders. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that this might be the meta team playbook this year. They have the 3-4 odd, which is always important. They also have the bear. They have the 4-3 even 6-1, which is very important to me to have because this is one of the best blitzing uh, defenses in the game. They have the big nickel over G, which is also one of the best pass defenses in the game. Big reason they're up here. They have the 3-3-5, which to me is the meta still, and has been for the last couple years. As a 3-3-5, uh, odd, which is called a 3-3 odd right now. The 2-4 double mug, which is always important. So, you know, to me, their nickel package is on point. They're not really missing anything. They also have the dime, which looks like, um, you know, this here looks like your, your dollar replacement. It's only really one package, but they don't really have any, like nothing's really wasted. Every single package here has a purpose. Next up, we have the Tennessee Titans. This particular playbook makes this list for one specific reason, and that's the 3-2 mug dollar. This particular formation is probably the best dollar version in the game in my opinion as far as run fits and pass rush i love this defense it makes the list just for that although it does have the regular dime which is essentially the dollar the two three will so they have both uh, which is going to be very important because those are two of the best in the game you have your regular nickel 
Sparkle Package, your 3-3 Cub, which like I said, that's pretty essential. And then you have your Double Mug, uh, which is really all you need. But what really makes this playbook unique as well, other than the dollar, is the 4-4 split, which I haven't really gone over yet. One of the best run defenses in the game, a very good defense. Uh, then when you get to their 3-4, they don't have the odd. They do have the even and the under, which are very good 3-4 sets. That's probably the second and third best 3-4 set. And then last but not least, we have the Multi-D defense. This here uh, really makes it because of one thing. I mean, it's been meta for a while based on the fact that you have the 3-3-5 and the 3-3-5, or it's called the 3-3 and the 3-3 Cub now. But a lot of people like to use this combination of plays. Other than that, though, they have some really good uh, formations. I mean, they have the 4-3-100 is actually one of the better 4-3 formations, in my opinion. But they do have the 3-4 odd, which is very important if you're going to use a playbook like this. The 5-2 normal looks a lot like the 3-4 three, 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 odd. But at the end of the day, this is a pretty good formation, especially when it comes to run defense, because it has three defensive tackles. Has your regular nickel, has your dime, has your dollar. So that's it. That's the vid. If you guys want to see an updated version of this video, as always, hit the like button. Let me know in the comment section. Other than that, thanks for watching, man. Mice it out. Need more help or just want to show your support? Then head over to my Patreon and join my team, where you can get exclusive content like ebooks and bonus plays, as well as early access to my vids and more. Link in the description below.